Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to teach you how to read your Nbot specific coins record. Record. Okay, later we'll show you how to read this record. But before that, let's jump into our bag, our profit, as you can see right here. We are making consistent profit since we start this bot. So, so far, so good, guys. And if I look at my position, uh, it is under 20%, which is great. If I check my Binance, my risk is still below 5%, so I'm good. If my risk above 5%, I maybe will top up more money. Uh, anyway, so let's go to trade and you will see your end bot coin. Okay, let's use this coin example. I will use rune. Uh, you can see my rune here is negative 42 USDT. So you can see the floating is negative 42 USDT. And basically you can see on my PC uh, for rune or Tor chain, uh, you can see it's just going up like crazy. So obviously your short position is going to be floating loss. Okay, as you can see here floating minus 13%. So here I'm going to teach you how to read your record here. Uh, you can click the record. So every transaction on Nbot guys, it is recorded. Okay, it is matching with your Binance record. If you see your Binance trade history, uh, it should match. So we can see on my rune here, uh, the bot open at this price. 5.75 so i can see right here you can see even the date and the time 11 of march so somewhere around here guys it opened 5.7 uh, this is the price and the amount amount meaning is the coin amount guys uh, let me show you the top one first so you can see at the very top here okay amount is 24 okay it means at this price at the sum sum is size okay sum is size you can see the size here look at the size 365 so why this is 177 you actually need to add since the bot open which is the 33 35 77 uh, 177 you add those up they are close to the size okay it, it, it is close to the size it's not the same it's not exact because there is slippage uh, there is fee etc so basically that's what it means so the amount here it says 24 because we have the size of 177 if i put here 177 usdt you can see the coin amount is around 23 or 24 okay that what it means and pnl meaning is profit and loss if you see plus you know the green color the green digit it means that it is the profit and loss obviously this is bot cover or bot open so you will see zero right there you only should see the number only when look at the tp which is take profit okay you can see the take profit uh, let's start from the bottom again the bot open at this price five dollars seven five cent the amount of rune is six and then the sum is $34. Your actual margin is divided by 20x, guys. Remember, the sum or the size is already included your leverage. Because my leverage is 20, I need to divide by 20 to know my real margin. Okay, so and then the bot cover when the price goes up. Obviously, because this is a short. And then it takes profit when the price goes down. You can see the price don't need to go down below 5.75, right? 5.88, we already take the profit. Because why? Because we do the averaging. Because the bot cover, we do the averaging, guys. You can see later at this price, 5.89, the bot open again. Then the price goes down, 5.83, the bot take profit. And goes on and on and on. The bot keep buying and take profit until until now the bot open at price 5.6 and the price has been going up since then 
Uh, that's why we are seeing huge floating but not to worry when the price you know when the market have a correction when the market have this slight pullback uh, we will take the profit at even higher 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 profit guys so uh, you can see right even though you can see since 11 of march although it keep going up right look look at this it goes down a little bit right it goes down a little bit this is where we take the profit did you see that this is why i i told you i told you even though the market keep going up the market never goes out like this guys okay it never goes out like straight line like this it will always always go up like this or we we even have a slight pullback maybe going up again and we have a slight pullback a retracement or whatever you want to call it and eventually guys eventually we will have a bear market right we will have a bear market you know the same thing for the bear market this is how the market works guys okay and why would i use end bot because you know just look at it look at how many coin i'm playing 12 coin guys i'm playing with 12 coin can you imagine if you do manual trading okay if you do manual trading you you look at 12 different coin you know 12 different chart your brain will explode guys okay imagine if i were to do 12 different coin to do technical analysis on 12 different coin my brain will explode okay this is why i'm using the bot but i also do manual trading guys because you know i like trading sometimes so you can see i have a manual coin here that i'm playing uh, this is not using the bot it's called ftm uh, you can see i don't have ftm here okay if you see my bot i don't have ftm okay so uh, this ftm i manual trade you can see you know if you manual trade is more dangerous than using a bot you know using bot is much safer uh, this is why i'm using n bot to trade most of the time and i'm very busy guys so i'm doing other thing i let the bot do its thing the only thing i pay attention to is the risk the liquid price should be far away from my mark price okay the risk should be below five percent and then position should be you know i want to keep it below 20 percent if can you know if it goes that i can you know just wait or i can add more capital uh, so that 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 basically it guys uh, there's nothing to worry about uh, just make sure you do your money management right you know to avoid liquidation if you have liquidation again all your thing will go to zero so try to have a uh, money management don't overplay it don't play too many coins again 200 to 300 dollar per coin okay 200 to 300 dollar per coin people keep asking me the same question although i already done all the video explaining people still ask me the same question i don't know why okay guys 200 to 300 per coin per coin okay per short coin remember we are using dca ai one is short and one is long okay so this is the sweet spot this is safe this is very safe if you want to try 100 you know it's very aggressive you need to prepare a lot of funds some people just love aggressive you know but but this is the safe the safe side okay 200 300 per coin uh, if you want to be more aggressive it's up to you do it with your own risk this is how you read your record here okay guys uh, if you have any question again go back to my playlist guys uh, watch my crypto futures here you know i've done all the tutorial the settings the menu everything i told you already